city dwellers are urged to be more involved in rainforest conservation for a greener future environment. Pratupuhan Palindong Kazana Alam estimated that only 4% of the world's tropical rainforests are protected by law. This year, Save Our Rainforest Race will be held in Hutan Simpan Sungai Besi, Kuala Lumpur. Are you aware of that? You know we have a small little forest here? Beautiful. And it is the last biggest forest left in the city. It's about 42 hectares. Pertubuhan Pelindung Khazanah Alam, or known as Peker Malaysia, has always tried to be the force to ensure the protection and conservation of our natural environment, namely our tropical rainforest. One of the most efficient ways to help in the conservation and protection of our rainforest is awareness and education. Director General of Forestry Department Peninsula Malaysia, Datuk Professor Dr. Haji Abdul Rahman says the forest reserve in Sungai Besi Churas cultivates plants for scientific purposes. See nature, see life is Pekas motto to stop the destruction of natural resources and create awareness about its sustenance. In her keynote address, Tun Jin Abdullah expresses her concern that Kuala Lumpur may have grown too fast and too soon, thus wiping out many trees. That's why when Landscape Malaysia, this little NGO that we set up was called Landscape Malaysia, it was not about landscaping the garden. It was really about bringing back all the landscape we had before we became this beautiful city. But everybody thinks of commodity, commodity, commodity. Everything must be planted in plantations, but not necessary. Some, yes. Most trees live long lives, but the value of that tree when it comes down is that a commodity. That is so expensive to do. In the collaborative effort to promote awareness of deforestation in Malaysia, Pertubuhan Pelindung Kazana Alam with Perhutanan Semenanjung Malaysia urges city dwellers to participate in the Safe Our Rainforest Race 2014. The race, held on March 29, is a 10km trail walk in Hutan Simpan Sungai Besi to replant trees and generate biodiversity in that area. This will be the first in-city forest race.